Are you ready to take control of your health? Today, we unveil the truth behind four diets that escalate diabetes signs. From trendy trends to age-old myths, we dive deep into the science, revealing which diets could be silently sabotaging your health. Stay tuned as we uncover the secrets to a balanced lifestyle, empowering you to make informed choices for a healthier tomorrow. Number 1. High Sugar Diets primarily consist of foods and beverages with high levels of refined sugars and simple carbohydrates. These include sugary snacks, candies, desserts, sodas, fruit juices, and processed foods. When consumed, these high sugar foods cause a rapid spike in blood glucose levels, overwhelming the body's ability to produce enough insulin or properly utilize it. Over time, this constant flood of sugar can lead to insulin resistance, where the cells become less responsive to insulin signals, resulting in persistently elevated blood sugar levels. Furthermore, frequent consumption of high sugar foods can lead to weight gain and obesity, both of which are significant risk factors for developing type 2 diabetes. Additionally, high sugar intake contributes to inflammation in the body, further exacerbating insulin resistance and diabetes symptoms, leading to insulin resistance, weight gain, inflammation, and ultimately poor blood sugar control. Number 2. Low-fiber diets. Characterized by a lack of foods containing dietary fiber, such as fruits, vegetables, whole grains, nuts, and seeds, Dietary fiber refers to the parts of plant foods that the body cannot digest or absorb. Instead, it passes relatively intact through the digestive system, aiding in various bodily functions. In the context of diabetes, low-fiber diets can exacerbate the condition in several ways. Fiber slows down the absorption of sugar in the bloodstream, preventing rapid spikes in blood sugar levels after meals. Without an adequate intake of fiber, blood sugar levels can rise more quickly, leading to insulin resistance and worsening diabetes symptoms. Fiber-rich foods help improve insulin sensitivity, allowing the body to use insulin more effectively to regulate blood sugar levels. When dietary fiber is lacking, insulin sensitivity can decrease, making it harder for cells to respond to insulin and causing blood sugar levels to remain elevated fiber plays a crucial role in maintaining a healthy digestive system by promoting regular bowel movements and supporting the growth of beneficial bacteria in the gut. A low-fiber diet can lead to constipation and other digestive issues, which may exacerbate diabetes symptoms and interfere with nutrient absorption. High-fiber foods tend to be more filling and can help control appetite, reducing the likelihood of overeating and promoting weight loss or maintenance. Obesity is a significant risk factor for type 2 diabetes, so a low-fiber diet that contributes to weight gain can further escalate diabetes signs and complications. Low-fiber diets can worsen diabetes signs by impairing blood sugar control, reducing insulin sensitivity, compromising gut health, and contributing to weight gain. Therefore, incorporating a variety of fiber-rich foods into the diet is essential for managing diabetes and promoting overall health. Number 3. High Saturated, Fat Diets Consist of Foods High in Saturated Fats. When consumed excessively, these fats can lead to insulin resistance, a condition where cells become less responsive to insulin, the hormone responsible for regulating blood sugar levels, insulin resistance hampers the body's ability to effectively utilize glucose, leading to elevated blood sugar levels. Additionally, high saturated fat diets can trigger inflammation in the body, further worsening insulin resistance and increasing the risk of type 2 diabetes. Furthermore, saturated fats contribute to weight gain and obesity, both of which are significant risk factors for diabetes. As excess body fat accumulates, particularly around the abdomen, it releases inflammatory chemicals that disrupt insulin signaling. Number 4. Highly processed foods are products that have undergone extensive processing, often containing added sugars, unhealthy fats, artificial additives, and refined carbohydrates. Examples include sugary snacks, fast food, 
packaged meals, many processed foods have a high glycemic index, meaning they cause a rapid spike in blood sugar levels after consumption. This sudden increase triggers the pancreas to release large amounts of insulin to help regulate blood sugar. Over time, this can lead to insulin resistance, a hallmark of type 2 diabetes, where the body's cells become less responsive to insulin's effects. Processed foods are often stripped of their natural fiber content during processing. Fiber plays a crucial role in slowing down the absorption of sugars into the bloodstream, helping to stabilize blood sugar levels. With Many processed foods contain unhealthy fats, such as trans fats and saturated fats, which have been linked to insulin resistance and inflammation. Processed foods are often calorie-dense but nutrient-poor, meaning they provide a high number of calories without offering significant nutritional benefits. Consuming an excess of calories, especially from processed foods high in sugars and fats, can contribute to weight gain and obesity, both of which are risk factors for type 2 diabetes. Processed foods frequently contain additives and preservatives to enhance flavor, texture, and shelf life. Some of these additives may have negative effects on metabolic health and contribute to insulin resistance and inflammation. Limiting the consumption of processed foods and focusing on whole, nutrient-dense foods is crucial for managing diabetes and promoting overall health. The impact of diet on diabetes cannot be overstated. Each choice can either support or sabotage our health. By prioritizing whole, nutrient-dense foods and minimizing processed, sugary, and high-fat options, we empower ourselves to take control of our health and mitigate the risks associated with diabetes. Remember, small changes today can lead to significant improvements tomorrow. Thank you for tuning in to explore the impact of diets on diabetes signs matter. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with friends and family who might benefit, and subscribe to our channel for more valuable content on managing diabetes and improving overall health. Until next time, stay healthy and informed.